Completing a project from the ground up isn't easy when the language and environment is different from anything you've ever known. That's what a group of Ole Miss Engineers Without Borders students learned on a recent trip to Africa to build a schoolhouse. Our goal was to try to build as much as we could while we were there. And um, we're pleased with the reasonable amount that we accomplished uh, with the limitations that we faced. Um, so we'll call that phase one. And we look forward to going back to do phase two, which is complete this and maybe even the next classroom. Communicating was both a struggle at times. Uh, just because some of, some of the villagers didn't speak English and others spoke very little English, it helped me realize that sometimes you have to say the same thing in several different ways and then they have to repeat it back to you to make sure that they understand what you're trying to say. And a lesson in universal truths as one student learned. Wherever I was I knew there were like a couple kids following me and even if I was doing a project they would want to try and help me do it. And it was kind of cool to just have that bond with them and we didn't even speak the same language and that experience like taught me that language wasn't a barrier for us. The future engineers also learned more about themselves. In high school I always did service work but I never did it to this degree. Um, I want to do structural engineering as my job after college and so being able to work on this project and build a school with my own hands, I worked on the design and the build so that way I really understand what goes into it and I think in the future it's going to help me a lot when designing other projects. It's different to uh, see you know your your work put into place actually you know going from a theoretical classroom aspect and then putting it out in the field really makes it world of difference you know seeing what you're capable of and uh, what you can accomplish with what work you've done. And discover that life's lessons are taught both inside and outside of the classroom. Yeah, it, it looks great on, on a resume, but even more than that, it's the experience. Uh, going, on, going into an interview, most kids are saying, oh, I've been at school for four years, I've learned this, this is my GPA. But they can't say, I've had my hands in the concrete, I have tied rebar together for a grid, I've measured everything out, I know the spacings. It's, uh, I think the experience speaks volumes. I look forward to the opportunity to be a reference for any one of these students at any time in their careers.